So now, why are we in this slavery today? Are they even still teaching this in school? Are y'all still in school? Are they even still teaching this? Yo, cause your enemy ain't gonna teach you the truth. Yo, what you expect? Yo, yo, you think your enemy is gonna give you the key for you to unlock your shackles to rule over them? You think they're gonna do that? Hell no, I'm gonna tell you that right now. Hell no, they're not gonna do that. They love having their foot propped up on your back, watching you create their kingdom. No, that time is over. Read what you got. Give me Deuteronomy 20. I'm going to show you why we're in the conditions we are today and how to fix them. And how to fix them. And it's simple things. The laws of God are simple. Right? Give me Deuteronomy chapter 28. Y'all understand that this is talking about the Israelites. Y'all know, y'all ever heard of Moses? Y'all ever heard of Moses? What color y'all think Moses was? So y'all know Moses is a black man, right? But what notion in our mind has, him thinking, has us thinking that he's a white man? Who taught us that? Church? Who runs the churches? The white man run them churches. When were you at in slavery? The, all these religions came about when we were in slavery. And we still serving them to this day. Because we don't get it. Keep God's commandments. We don't get that point. Alright, so why my, my brother that just walked out? I'm asking you the same thing that I asked my brothers here. Why did the black man and black woman go into slavery? Do you know? I'm still on the, I'm still on, you gave a, you gave a great answer. You gave a great answer, but we're going to give you the answer out of the Bible, all right? In 1492, we was taken into slavery because of our ancestors, our own ancestors, mm -hmm. sold us into slavery. No. That is part of this, these 12 times <clears throat> which you're talking, which was talked about in, um, it, it, um, Exodus. He said our own ancestors sold us into slavery. Right. Now, brother, we were taught that in school, but guess what? That's a lie. That is a lie. We're going to prove, yes, that is a lie. We're going to prove that today, thus saith the Lord. When you step up, understand something. You're stepping in front of the prophets, and we're going to teach you the truth. We're going to teach you the truth. This is why we went into slavery. Deuteronomy chapter 28 and read verse 15. Y'all listen up. Y'all listen up. Y'all listen up. We're going to give y'all the truth. Everything we've taught here, you've been taught by your oppressor. Your oppressor ain't going to tell you the truth. Your brothers is going to tell you the truth. Thus saith the Lord. Read what you got. Deuteronomy chapter 28 verse 15. Read what you got. Deuteronomy chapter 28 verse 15. Come on. But it shall come to pass. It shall a uh, maybe is this a maybe or a kinda or is it if I said you shall go into the store is that a you might go into the store is that a huh is that a is that a, I might I might not no that's a guarantee you're going in the store y'all yo y'all y'all listening y'all listening up y'all listen up pay attention yeah, is it is it a maybe you gonna go to the store if I said Jeremiah shall go into the store is that a maybe you might change your mind you might change your mind. No. That means no, you're that going into that store, right? So y'all listen up, y'all listen up. You're not gonna be taught this anywhere else. You're not gonna be taught this anywhere else. This is the truth and reality what happened to us as a people. All right, listen up. But it shall come to pass uh -huh. if thou wilt not hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy God. What does it mean to hearken? Like you're hearkening unto me right now. What does that mean? You're what? Good, good. You agree? Y'all agree? Your little brother with the do-rag. What's your name anyway? I'm Ali. I'm a Moor. Ali. Okay. All right. Listen around, Ali. You're going to learn something today, especially about the Moors. You're learning right now. All it means is black. That's all it means. That's all it means. Listen up. Read. To observe to do all his commandments. To do what? All his commandments. To observe. So if you're observing the time, what are you doing with the time? You're looking at, you're watching it. It's an action. It's not a, it's not a, it's not me just saying it, just to be saying it, right? It's an action. You're looking at the time. So God said, you observe, you watch, you do, to do what? To do all his commandments. We're going to teach y'all some commandments because I'm going to tell you this right now. You not knowing the commandments has us in slavery today. Right. Us break, not knowing and breaking them. It has us serving the white man, the Chinese man, the Arab man, which is when we, the reason why we had to go under the title as the Moors because we went into servitude under the Arab man. Right. 
and we got identity from that. But that's not originally what we were. We we're the Israelites. That's exactly what the original where we come from, what we are. Right? So because of a result of our enslavement, we changed our names. We're, the point is we're still serving our enemies because you don't know what you're supposed to be doing today. Right? All right? So we're going to teach y'all some commandments. So continue reading. To observe, to do all his commandments and his statutes, which I command thee this day. No, uh, yesterday. This day. Meaning still till this day. Read. That all these curses. All these what? All these curses. Y'all ask them last one by one. Is curses good things? Are, are curses good things? Cur are curses are good things? A curse. If I curse you, is that a good thing? No, it's not a good thing. If I curse you, is that a good thing? You can curse yourself. Is cursing a good thing? Is curse if I curse you, is that a good thing? God has curses on us right now. When you walk away, just because you walk away does not change the fact that we are cursed people right now. Right. You're gonna go, you walk down that street and go do what you go, you're still cursed, Jeremiah. You walk, you go, you go to, you travel, you go to New York, you're still going to be cursed, Jeremiah. We're trying to show y'all what y'all need to be uncursed so you can be prosperous in everything that you do. Don't you want to be prosperous in everything that you do? You have a child on the way, right? Right. Don't you want to rear your child up to be a God that is supposed to be? It's, you, uh, to be the, the, the child... Uh, of God that the Most High calls me the Israelites. Don't you want that? Don't you want your, your lineage to be blessed and holy? Don't you want that? Right, what father went and want that for his kids? But I'm telling you this right now, you walk away, you're not going to get this nowhere else. You're going to stay cursed, bruh. And we're giving you the answers how to unlock that. Look, we're going nowhere fast, bruh. Look, you're going to tell me whatever you're going to tell me, bruh. I'm going to keep teaching this Bible, whether you see it or not. I'm trying to give you the answers how to uh, free yourself and your lineage out of this hell that we're in you know what i'm saying we're gonna keep teaching read what you got dude. hey brother hey come come over here and deal with me all right you're gonna go you're gonna go come over here and deal with me bro why are we in slavery today why does the bible say that read verse 15 again but it shall come to pass if thou wilt not hearken unto the voice of the lord thy god if thou wilt not hearken like you're hearkening now, right, Ali? You're hearkening, you're listening now, right? Some simple. The Bible is not a complicated book. The Bible is not a complicated book. Listen, read. Hebrew version. Read. You is not reading the Hebrew that one, language. Can you, can you understand what's coming out of my mouth right now? This English. Can you understand this when I'm coming out of your That's mouth? That's the language Go. that I read with curse back. Listen, read. Whether you in Spanish, German, French, we're still cursed as a people, Ali. No matter where you go. Yeah, you know so it don't matter what language you're speaking, you bro. Have no you have no nationality, you will always but be But it shall come to pass, if thou wilt not hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy God, read, to observe to do all his commandments uh -huh. and his statutes, uh -huh. which I command thee this day, Come on. that all these curses, all these what? All these curses. We are a cursed people, right. whether you want to realize it or not. That's right. You are subject to... You are subject to whatever the white man or whatever nation deals out to us because we are cursed. Don't y'all want to know how to come out of these curses? Who wants to remain cursed? You, we don't prosper in nothing. We don't. We, we're, we're at the bottom. We are hurting Teach. as a people. No other nation needs the help that we need. And we're only going to get that from this Bible. That's the only way we're going to get that. Keep reading. Let's read some of these curses. And all of you tell me if this is happening or not. Or has it happened? Read verse 32. Verse 32. Come on. Thy sons and thy daughters shall be given unto another people. Now, and I want to harp on to your point. Were our sons and our daughters not given to the so-called white man? Teach. Yes or no? You, you, yes or no? You asking yes all the questions, or no. but you won't answer them. Answer the question. It's a simple yes or no. It's the black man sold onto answer the white one man. one more time, and then you answer my question. You, we're the ones teaching. What's the so-called black man sold to the white man? You can learn yes, from a baby. Yes, they were. You What's the so-called black man sold onto the Arab? Yes, they were. We used to scream black power while Heron was pushed. But at the end of the day, nothing's in vain. IUIC has been given a vision. The tents of Judah has risen. Many has attempted the mission. Minor murmuring, omitting, and missing the mark.
Just reading that he had the flame of fire in his eyes gave us the spark. We on Paul's mission. We out on the road, purple and gold. From Mexico, Cuba, Haiti, Ghana, Sierra Leone. 144,000 boots banging, concrete crackling. These are how our men repented at heart. The scriptures is proof. IUIC, we deliver the truth.